comes down to this. A spot in the NCAA tournament is on the line, and it's the NEC volleyball title between the Bryant Bulldogs and the Sacred Heart Pioneers. She's going to get hers. She's going to make it easy for her teammates. But you cannot let her have free reign near the net. And sent long. Sacred Heart with a start to looking for three straight points off the bat. Where the Bulldogs do have the advantage this afternoon coming into play early. Eperd, and she's rejected. And they're just timing it up right now. They're anticipating, and they, I mean, they were both there with plenty of time there, right in McGovern. And when you got a group as talented as this one on with um, in Sacred Heart, it's not surprising able to get back in this one and slow the momentum that Bryant had in the early going. McGovern is blocked. That time it was Fairchild with Palanchi. NEC championship game. Just misses the sideline. And this set is even, 21 apiece. And Brian head coach, Teresa Garlisty, calls a timeout. And Sacred Heart, they're out of timeouts as well. Neither team has one left, so we're playing this set out. McGovern for the set. Tough time handling it. Can Sacred Heart send it over? They do, says it keeps it alive. Riley James for the set. That's it. The Bulldogs take the opening set in the NEC final. Not blocked that time, but just had a lot of trouble. How about the pancake from McGovern? Unable to get anything past him. Kennedy a swing. A deflection off the roof. Smallcomb does well to read it. But the third touch, not enough. At what point, if you're Sacred Hearts, you start asking, what else do we have to do? I mean, Emma McGovern lifted that thing right off the floor. And a service ace, Dominique Felix. Rogers serves now. Sizik can't get it. Oh, she does get it through the block. James was there along with Haley O'Brien. The Pioneers looking to put it away. Sergo leads this team in aces with 34. Well handled. Back to Polanchi. Second time. Couldn't put it away though. Rolled over by Kennedy. Sizik tries right up at the net. It's a free ball. Sizik again. And Bryant can't get there. Sarah Sizik, the setter of the year, puts the second set away. Well, Bryant's got the early edge. Tough time handling to make it four straight for the Bulldogs. That keeps your service run going. And rejected. It's Eford and Fairchild there. And a big point for the Pioneers coming out of the timeout. Now have themselves set point. Five set point opportunities for the Pioneers. Looking to take a commanding 2-1 advantage. It's blocked. And the point for Sacred Heart. That does it. The third set in the books. Pioneers win it two, or lead it two to one, going into the fourth. Sergo who leads all Bulldogs players in service aces. Kennedy off the block. 
Bryant and Sacred Heart even at nine. Rodgers rejected. Fairchild finishes five championship point opportunities. Dominique Felix serving for the NEC title. Kennedy sends it long. And the Pioneers are your 2021 NEC champs. And Drew Shelley is standing by with Sarah Sizik. Here with tonight's player of the game, Sarah Sizik. Sarah, first off, congratulations. I know this meant a lot to you and your team. Thank you, thank you. You know, you guys lost the first set. Bryant came out aggressive. They blocked real well on that first set. What did you guys do from sets two through four to really limit that and take this match? So we knew Bryant was a very energetic team, and we knew if we stayed cool, calm, and collected, we were going to ride out with more energy than them. Olivia mentioned it yesterday, not being able to play last year in the championship game. How much fuel did that add to making sure you could come out here and, and finish the job today? A lot. We were very devastated by it, but we knew that this season we were going to come back and get it. Well, not your last match. Now you guys look forward to the NCAA tournament. What type of experience do you think that's going to be for you and your team? We've been trying to get back here for two years now, and I think we've been preparing for this whole season to get back to where we are right now. Sarah Sizik, four-time NEC set of the year, and now for the second time in NEC championship. Sarah, good luck in the tournament and congratulations. Thank you. Back over to Austin. Well, thanks, Drew. Sarah Sizik with her second double-double in as many matches, triple-double, I should say, in as many matches. Today, 18 digs, 10 kills, and 31 assists in the four-set victory over Bryant. This is a Sacred Heart team that got production out of Fairchild today. 12 kills, not the same 21 she had yesterday, but they didn't need it. Played a rather clean match, didn't make mistakes from the service line. And for the third, for the second time this season, they take down Bryant, this one in the all-important NEC championship. Drew Shelley now standing by with Sacred Heart head coach Rob Machen. Here with Sacred Heart head coach Rob Machen. Coach, congratulations. That was a great effort by you and your squads out tonight. I appreciate that. We fought really hard. Bryant was incredible tonight. That was a fantastic match. One of the best I've been a part of in my career. Yeah, the energy was here early. Bryant came out and blocked the ball exceptionally well. Seven first set blocks. Absolutely. You know, they had all the energy in, in the building. What were you guys able to do to limit that and then really take control of the matches that went we on? What we talked about is they're playing fantastic. We had to just honestly just maintain our composure and do what we do on our side. They were really doing a great job. We were able to kind of wait that out, and I think the match kind of got into a rhythm, and at that point, we kind of took control. Sarah did it yesterday. She did it again today, another triple-double. You know, the impact she has, you can't even really go into words at this point, but you can tell how much she really put in to win that match tonight. We talk, any, any fan of the game is going to love to watch her play. She just dominates in all aspects. The service line she dominates. I mean, we want her back there serving all the time, too. She does everything for us. Going into the NCAA tournament now, you know, going back for the second time in the last couple of years, you guys know you're going to be facing a high-quality opponent in, the, in round one. What are you guys going to have to do to go out and compete with any team in the country we once talk, the bracket comes out? We talk about it all the time. You know, we're going to have to be the aggressor. We can't be passive against them. You can't let them keep hitting you. We have to hit them as much as we can, serve as tough as we can, try to knock them off balance, and then take our shot. Well, Coach, I'm going to let you go celebrate with the team and go grab your NEC championship trophy, and good luck in the tournament. That is Sacred Heart. Much. Head Coach Rob Machen, back over to Austin.